we'll be showing you how to convert your mouse sensitivity from Fortnite to Kovacs and how to avoid some of the common mistakes made with this process. The obvious way is to set your sensitivity scale to Fortnite percent, enter your Fortnite sensitivity and then go to your FOV measurements and set it to Fortnite. The problem here is that Fortnite has a very low field of view compared to other games, so most popular scenarios in Kovacs will feel too zoomed in. If you don't mind how this looks, you can stick with that method, but if you want to train on higher fields of view, then try out this next solution. Now, a common alternative adopted by players is to use Overwatch 103 for their field of view while keeping their Fortnite sensitivity the same. This can work, but you'll likely notice that it feels different or wrong, and that's because we haven't applied focal length scaling. We wrote up a blog about this, which we'll link to in the description if you want to learn more about it. To keep this video short and sweet, let's jump right to the best method where you can train on higher fields of view like 103 while still maintaining the same feeling as if you were on Fortnite's 80, letting you get that effective one-to-one -one training without feeling zoomed in. Enter the string on screen into a calculator. We recommend using the same calculator to avoid any potential issues. We have a link to this one in the description, and we also have the formula written in the description so you can simply copy paste it. This number here is the field of view you want to train on. Now 103 is very popular, but you could put whatever you want here. This number down here is your Fortnite field of view, and you don't need to change this. And this number is your Fortnite sensitivity. And finally, this number here is your new sensitivity in Kovacs. I'll run through an example of how this process works. Say my Fortnite sensitivity is 8.4%, and I want to train a 103 field of view. I would open up the calculator and I'll go and paste in the formula. Now this top number would stay the same because I want to train on 103. And then I would enter my Fortnite sensitivity here, which is 8.4. And then I would copy the output. I would then head into Kovacs, select Fortnite percent for my scale, and then paste in my new sensitivity. And since I want to play on 103 Overwatch, I set it to Overwatch and enter 103. Those games use the same scale, so it doesn't matter which one you choose. And now I can comfortably play any scenario with a one-to-one -one feeling between Fortnite and Kovacs. If you have any questions about this process, please leave a comment below or reach out to us on Discord. And as always, thanks for watching.